Hello everyone, my name is Jozef and I am Mr. Musette. I am a full-time illustrator and in my free time I create art and illustration related videos here on YouTube. If you are new to my channel, feel free to subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. In this video I create another two mermaids for the mermaid 2022 illustration challenge. And the illustrations are for the prompts from day 5 and day 6. The prompt for the day 5 was symbiotic. The most common example of a symbiotic which I could find was the symbiotic between a sea anemone and a clownfish. These two organisms benefit the other. The anemone provides the clownfish with protection and shelter, while the clownfish provides the anemone nutrition in the form of waste while also scaring off potential predator fish. So I decided to go with this idea as fits really well with the mermaid team. So I drew this clownfish mermaid surrounded by sea anemones. This was really fun to draw and paint and I think is my favorite so far. I love everything about this illustration, the composition and the color scheme as well. The day 6 prompt was Doodle. For this illustration I drew this sailor tattooed merman who has all these Doodle tattoos on his torso. And initially here I wanted to create only the line art but I couldn't help myself to don't use some colors so I decided that I will make a monochromatic coloring for this merman. But after I committed to this idea, I instantly regretted it. Because I think that this illustration would look much more cooler if I painted it normally as I do in general in my illustration and use more colors. I was even thinking to redraw this illustration and paint it properly, but then I realized that I don't have time for that and at the end I will not be happy with all the illustrations I will create in this challenge. And the idea is not to create only perfect illustrations and some days I will have less inspired days, which is fine. And actually this illustration looks much more better in real life than it looks scanned. 
so I am fine with that. For these illustrations I used again my handmade sketchbook with the Fabriano paper for the line art Stadler pigment liners and for the coloring this time I used the Paul Rubens watercolor set and some Posca pens. As I said I really like how turned out the illustration from the beginning of the video and I am less happy with the second one but maybe I will approach this illustration in another video redrawing it and paint it as I would normally. Hope you enjoyed this video and you are enjoying this more May illustration series. I will try to upload as much as I can on my channel so if you like my style and my videos feel free to subscribe and come back the next time. But these days I have so many projects running in the background that I try to do all of them and at the end of the day I have the impression that I didn't do almost anything. Until my next video you can follow me on my Facebook or Instagram where I post my other projects which I am working on. Thanks for watching and until next time do not forget, life is a song, illustrate it.